Hey guys, my name is Tony Camel. I'm a creature artist and I'm currently working as a freelancer in the entertainment industry. Today I'm gonna show you this book, Seabrush Characters and Creatures, published by 3D Total. I'm going to flip through the book and pick out some parts that I really liked and I learned a lot from. So, let's get started. First of all, I'd like to show you the content of the book. Um, as you can see, it's split into several parts like speed sculpting, quadrupeds, creatures, aliens, and so on. Um, now I will flip through the speed sculpting tutorials very quickly because I'd like to show you this. Uh, the quadrupeds section. And in this tutorial by Daniel Basted, I hope I pronounced the name right, um, I first learned uh, that you have to know your uh, animal anatomy before you can start sculpting and creating your own realistic creature. And for example, in this picture, he's talking about how to uh, sculpt wrinkles and skin details on your creature. Also a very great uh, picture and, and example. And yeah, the final result will look like this. Very cool. Yeah. And flipping through the other tutorials very quickly. Justin Gobi Fields tutorial, very cool. And now we are coming to the creature section. Um, in this part, Brian Winia, I hope I pronounced the name right, he's talking about um, collecting reference images um, to get the anatomy right and to pick from um, for your creature design. And also uh, he's uh, starting, he's doing some creature sketches um, to get a better feeling of, of the creature, how does it walk or eat, and also he's thinking about the uh, shape language, <clears throat> which is very important. And yeah, after that, he jumps into ZBrush and starts sculpting. Final result. And other great creature tutorials, alien tutorials here. Oh, yeah. And here's a great tutorial by Craig Pupstein. Um, what I'd like to show you here, guys, are these little orange boxes called top tips. They are very, very great um, because the artist is um, giving you uh, more, a little more inside tip on, for example, on this, um, how to create glass in ZBrush. And um, yeah, you can find these orange boxes th throughout the book and um, they are very helpful to speed up your workflow and work way more efficiently. Yep. Great aliens are in this part, creating thumbnails in ZBrush very quickly. Also, great tutorial. Okay, and now we are coming to the creating fantasy figures. Also, a tutorial by Kurt Pupstein, and he's talking about um, how to create appealing cre uh, characters for um, video uh, games and film. And what I like, like to show you is um, this section, very, very cool, because um, Kurt is talking um, about how to create um, hair for your character using fiber mesh and the several groom brushes um, to create uh, yeah, realistic hair for your character. Very great tutorial, helped me a lot. And yeah, 
Another top tip box. And I guess this is the last tutorial. Sculpting a sci-fi character. Also a great one. Yeah. And the last part of the book is the gallery where some great creature and character designs in there by various artists. Yep. That's it. I hope you enjoyed uh, this video and it was helpful and yeah, have fun with the book. Bye.